Hi guys, so today we're going to be talking about the Rodial Rodial uh, Super Acids Extreme Acid Rush Peel. Now this says it's the ultimate peel with 100% active azelaic acid plus glycolic, lactic and fruit acids and probiotic technology. Now you apply this, wait for 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse off with warm water. This is a 20ml sample tube that I got in a beauty advent calendar. The full size is 50ml and costs £75. So I'm going to apply this on half of my face um, and then we're going to compare the two sides. Now I'm going to zoom you in just a bit because I'm having quite a bad skin day um, so that we can see what this does. And as you can see I was um, slightly underestimating the badness of my skin day. So we're, we're very uneven, we're very blotchy, we've got flaky bits, um, it's pretty unpleasant. So let's get away from that <laughs> for just now. So I'm going to do the right side of my face, so I'll need to take my nose piercing out. And doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm assuming this is just going to be apply a thin layer. I've already washed and dried my face. And let's go. So it's just got a um, kind of fresh smell. It's not quite as zingy fruity as I was expecting, being an acid fruit peel. Um, doo -doo -doo. And it's just a very clear looking gel. So let's get this going. And I'm going to take that down my neck a bit because I've got a bit of decongestion, congestion even, <laughs> weird, block pores etc on my neck. So let's just see if we can improve them somewhat as well. So as you can see it doesn't really look like anything when it's on the skin. Um, the time now is 10.23 so I think I'll leave this for the full 15 minutes just because of how icky my skin's being just now and we will come back and I'll rinse it off let you know how it felt sitting with it on and then we will compare the two sides okay so it's been 15 minutes and I have rinsed this off so in terms of how it felt sitting for the 15 minutes I didn't feel any tingling any burning no discomfort so that's you know thumbs up for that uh, it was really easy to rinse off, so again, thumbs up. And I think my skin does look brighter on this side, which is the side we've actually done. I wasn't really expecting anything given how little I felt while this was on my skin, but I definitely feel this skin is smoother on this side. Uh, it looks brighter. And then let's zoom in um, so that you can get a nice close-up comparison. So... I feel that the skin is a little bit more even and smoother looking on this side that we've done um, compared to this one. Um, the redness of my skin actually looks reduced to me um, where normally I would have expected it to be flared up from an acid peely type product. So I'm definitely going to go and do the other side of my face. I'm definitely going to keep using this product. I can definitely see me rebuying it once I have enough money because, like I said, it's £75, <laughs> um, which is not uh, a very affordable price range for me right now. Um, but I definitely enjoy it. I definitely see results from it. I definitely feel it's gentle enough for most skin types. I think if you had the utterly, utterly most sensitive skin in the world, I don't think any kind of peel is going to be good for you. But certainly I felt no comfort, discomfort, not even any tingling from this one. So if you guys have got any questions about this, please leave them down below. But I am definitely rating this as a good buy product, even though it's not really in my price range. Hmm. Right, I will see you guys later. Bye!